Hi everyone, welcome to Jen the Real Fluencer. My channel here is all about helping you be your most confident self through style, fashion, and beauty. So welcome if you are new here or welcome back. Puffer jackets, you know, puffer jackets, okay. I have steered clear. I was waiting for these dang things to go out of style if I'm being totally honest, but it's been how many years that these things have been in style? I have stayed away. They seem to be getting more and more in style. So watch, this will be the year I invest in a puffer jacket and then next year they're just gonna be like, gone. You know what I'm saying? I have puffer jackets to show you today from Walmart and Target. I bought a lot of them because I was on a mission to find the best one. I'm almost doing like fitting room style here in my house. Am I keeping all these? Absolutely not. My goal is to keep two of them. One that is kind of longer and one that is shorter. I will tell you the longer one I'm completely decided upon. I love it. I'm obviously going to share it with you. So hopefully you'll love it too. But I am truly undecided on the short one. So I would love if as we go through here, like, help me decide which short one to keep. Tell me which one looks the least bad on me, the least worst, worst, worst on me. Help me, help me, help me with a short one. Please vote in the comments, please. <laughs> so if you're anything like me, you're curvy or midsize or whatever, and you feel like puffer jackets don't look good on you, we might be similar. So maybe consider subscribing because that's kind of a lot of what my channel is all about here. It's also just about general fashion style beauty that anybody can enjoy. Hit the subscribe button, it is free. Like, I can be super annoying. You can always dump me later. You know, just kick me to the curb later. Everything that I'm gonna be featuring here today is from Walmart or Target, or should I say like, what, what would it be? What Walget or Tarmart? Should I? <laughs> that is what's happening. If you would like to stay till the end, I do have a few bonus jackets that are not puffer jackets that I'd be happy to try on for you. So let's go. Tell me what you guys think. This one is my favorite one and let me tell you why. This one is from Target. It is in a size large it's from the brand A New Day. I know you guys are probably thinking, Jen, you probably really need the extra large. I hear that, but what I do like about this one is I'm probably going to wear it open a decent amount of the time and I feel like it does look really good open. But what I really like about it is I can zipper it. I feel like a lot of the times stuff that looks decent open, I either can't zipper it or, you know, whatever. It never works out that I can do both and feel kind of okay with each option, if that makes sense. A couple of the things that I absolutely love about this, I love that it has the little bungees on the inside here. I mean, these make all the difference. Anything that has that, that can just give you a little bit more shape, it makes all the difference. I love that that the zipper can go up and down so if you need a little bit more room at the bottom kind of like I did you can have that option weirdly I love this maybe some people think that looks like Count Dracula or something but it does of course have a hood and lastly the sides the fact that the sides can do this it's such a big deal. It is such a big deal that they do that. And if you know, you know. I feel like I'm gonna coin this like the curvy girl puffer jacket. It just works so great. Absolutely in love with it. <laughs> I just really have to give it to Target. This is another one, the brand A New Day. This is actually in a size medium. I was exclusively from kind of the get-go trying to probably order these from the standpoint of like, I'm going to wear them open. If you don't know what I mean, I can link my video, like eight unique ways to look thinner, where the concept about how I wear jackets, it's a, it's, it's a strategy of how I wear jackets. But because these are generally not gonna flatter my figure, I was just assuming I'd wear them open. So I wanna tell you that because I was shocked that like I could wear this size medium open and I technically can zipper it. Am I saying that it looks the best zippered or that like it's the best size for me when zippered no but like if I have this you know what I mean it can be zippered I, I guess is my point point. and other times I'd kind of wear it open I thought this color was absolutely beautiful I love that this kind of sticks up like that I could see maybe some people not liking that it does not have a um, hood though which really doesn't bother me so I can see some people not liking this but I actually really like it I just feel like it gives dimension I like that it kind of frames your face um, and yeah, tell me what you guys think. I love this color. I think it's absolutely beautiful. It's like a cobalt blue. I hope it's coming across. Okay, we've got a Walmart option from Time and True. So this one is their kind of shorter puffer jacket, meaning it goes right at my hips or right above my hips even, I would say. 
And this one is in a size medium. I can't zipper it, as you can see. This one was a little bit of a risk for me, but I don't know, I just wanted to try it. It's like white. Am I gonna look like freaking Frosty the Snowman, except Frosty probably is thinner than me, you know, whatever. I heard he's on Weight Watchers. It's a whole thing. Isn't it called WW now? Anyway. <laughs> Let's get back on track. This one really surprised me. I have to say, I really like it. Do I like it better than the Target blue one? I don't know. Like again, I probably just wanna keep one short puffer jacket. I don't know, but I do really like it. I don't think it packs on the pounds. And I'm actually just quite shocked that the white looks this good. I'm just joking, obviously. Like it looks decent, you know? I'm shocked that it looks decent. And it's not crop, but like I think the shorter length really makes a big difference here. I really do. This is another good one from Target. This is the brand Universal Thread. It is in a size medium. I feel, oh, I feel torn. I like this one. I like, it's a very different material. It's not that slippery material and it's quilted as you can see. And I love the kind of Sherpa upper, just so you know, it's only up there. It doesn't extend throughout. I feel like this thing would end up looking way more bigger otherwise. Love the front pockets, like the little square pockets with the flaps. And I think this color of mint is just absolutely Stunning. Did I hear mint's gonna be a color upcoming? I don't remember. If you guys know, let me know in the comments. It doesn't match my eyeshadow though, so that's exciting. Do I like it better than the cobalt blue one? Do I like it better than the snowman one from Walmart? I don't know, but I do like it. I do like it. I think the medium is good for me for wearing it definitively open. Does it look the most flattering on me? Not really. Not really, but I do like it. We are about halfway through this video, so please give the video a like if you are digging it so far and have found it helpful. It helps my channel out so much and I truly appreciate it. Okay, so this one really surprised me. This is Walmart by Scoop. I got this one with the intention that it would not close just to wear it open. It's in a size medium. And I was shocked that like I could zipper it no problem. So I feel like this one is borderline of me thinking like it looks decent on me. I love the shirt here. I love this cuff. Something about that. I feel like this reminds me of that, um, what was that Bon Jovi album? Was it in the 80s? Like, slippery when wet. I feel like that's what this reminds me of. It's a look. I feel like this one's like a little bit less of like, oh, just an everyday jacket you're gonna throw on. Like, I feel like this almost needs to be part of a look. I'm not saying I'd wear it as like a shirt jacket look, but I feel like it would go with certain things and obviously not other things. I'd be curious to know what this looks like in a small, and I know that sounds crazy. Meaning like when I go like that, I was expecting it to not close. And because it's so puffy because it's a puffer jacket that has Sherpa on the inside. I will be curious to know what it looked like in a small where it couldn't close. It was kind of part of a look or whatever. So this one's going to be, I think, a no for me in the medium, but I would be curious in a small. Am I going to order it? I don't know. TBD. Maybe it'll go on sale. Tell me what you think. As you guys probably remember with the black one, this is the identical version of it in the, what are we going to call this? Like, what is this? It's like a wet look. It's not, it's not leather. Pleather? Should we just call it pleather? This is the pleather option. Do I need both of these? I really don't, but I do really like this one. I ordered this also in a small, and I know that sounds totally crazy. Uh, you're like, uh, Jen, the large doesn't even fit you. What the actual heck? I, I feel that. I was thinking like to exclusively wear open. It didn't work out. Definitely too small. I would maybe need a medium, but honestly, I do think that the large looks fine. So it's like, Jen, just, just stop. Just stop while you're ahead. <laughs> I'm not gonna order this jacket three times and then also get it in a medium. So um, I'm just gonna quit while I'm ahead. But let me know down in the comments if you think if you think I should keep this one it has all the same benefits as the black one of course I don't really need to be redundant it's definitely a modern take I love this kind of foresty green I don't know I, I'm I am very torn on this one help me decide so yeah basically exactly like the last one I don't want to repeat myself it kind of has all the same things you know the interior bungees are they're everything I mean they make puffer jackets possible for me anyway the rest of it's kind of all the same as the cobalt blue one I don't know how I feel about this color I like the wet look kind of situation I really do pleather it's not pleather. What What is this? Like, what is this? I don't even, it's not a rain jacket. I just don't know that this color is the best. I mean, obviously I bought it because I like the color. That's not what I want to say. Maybe with the slipperiness of this and coupled with the color, it's just not the best. I don't know. This one's like kind of at the bottom of my list, but again, tell me what you guys think. I feel like this is like the quintessential Walmart time and true kind of thin 
skinny puffer jacket. So a couple things, it does have a hood. The hood is removable, which I love. And when you stick your fingers, when you stick your hands, not just your fingers, in the pockets, they feel fleece-like, which is great. It's very warm. It says it's packable. It talks about on the inside how it's like packable. I don't know. I feel like that's not super important to me personally. Overall, I like the way it feels. It doesn't feel heavy. This isn't a size large. It's obviously borderline. Like you can see it looks fine if it's open, but I feel like if I was going to definitively wear it open, I might consider a medium. Kind of like the other ones, I can technically zipper it. It doesn't look good when I do, but I feel like I don't really want to size up to an extra large. I feel like I should like this one more than I do. Maybe it just doesn't excite me. I'm not really sure. This one does come in a ton of colors though. It's like such a fan favorite. So not knocking this one at all. I just don't know if I like it more than even the other time and true one that we saw in white. I don't know about you guys, but I don't have room in my closet for 10 puffer jackets that would take up uh, a lot of real estate uh, in my closet. I can barely keep them here for the try on. It's ridiculous. <laughs> All right, there we go for the puffer jackets and we're gonna get into the bonus jackets next Don't forget though while we're looking at the bonus jackets Leave me let me know down in the comments which one looks the least terrible on me. Tell me, please I need your advice I would love to know what you guys think about this one. I love this one. This is from Target, the brand A New Day, in a size small. I got it specifically so that I wouldn't close it. And you know why I got it? I really like the look of doing lounge or athleisure and then kind of like a big long winter jacket over top of it. So that's kind of why I got this one. And I really like it. I am definitely keeping this one. It's exactly what I wanted. I feel like it's slimming. It's exactly what I look for when I size down in jackets and can't button them. So hopefully if you were confused throughout the prior part of this video, what is she talking about? She doesn't want to close a jacket. What does she mean? This is like the epitome of what I'm talking about. If I got this in a large, I could close it. It definitely would not look as flowery. It wouldn't look terrible. It's at least still black. It's dark. It's going to be slimming or as slimming as it can be. But I just feel like this looks so flattering and it's because it's in a size small. So if you didn't know what I meant earlier, that's what I'm referring to. Love this one. Let me know what you guys think. So this one I really like. It's from Walmart by the brand Scoop. I did get it in a size large based on their kind of um, moto jacket that's in like the faux leather. I just thought it'd be kind of similar to that. Oh, it is and it isn't at the same time. I do like all the details here on this one. This going on and all that. I don't love it in the large. I feel like this is one where I'd want to wear it open. Probably almost kind of like the other moto jacket, but maybe a little bit more of a substantial jacket. That jacket I would definitely wear with an outfit. It's like an outfit jacket. I feel like this one is a little bit more of an outdoor jacket, but I still would want to wear it open. So I feel like I would want to see this one in a medium, but had it here. So I thought I would show it to you guys in the large and I can zipper it as well. If you guys had $20 for every time that I tell you and me to not wear Sherpa because it looks bad on us, but then you watch me time and time again to try to make Sherpa look good on me, like you guys would be rich. Like we would all be so rich because that is how many times I have said <laughs> However, I think that this looks decent. This is in a size small. I like went in strong. I was like, look, it's Sherpa. It's a Sherpa moto jacket, which first of all, what a cool concept. Did I even say that this was from Walmart? I don't think I even friggin' said that. It's from Walmart by the brand Scoop. I love the concept of a moto jacket. I went in strong knowing if it was gonna look decent on me, it would have to be fitted. I think that strategy worked. I think that this looks as good as it's going to look on me, if that makes sense. I like it. I've never had a Sherpa jacket, never. Did I do it? Did I pull off Sherpa? All right, there we go. There we go. What's my return tally here? How many of these do I need to be returning? Cause we can't, we can't keep all of these. Love to hear all of your thoughts on what you think about these in general or on me. Please vote in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.